Grace is the central concept of Christianity. Grace allows us to know Jesus and to understand what he did and said and why. Grace gives us the framework to understand who God is and is not. Grace enables us to see ourselves as we truly are and to become all that we were created to be. Grace is the only thing that will bring about the healing of the world. <laughs> see, it's pretty central, right? Yet most of us don't think much about grace. At least we don't use it to define the best thing about our church, I don't think. We, we don't have it guide our daily routines. We certainly don't look in the mirror and say, ah, yeah, there it is, that's grace. <laughs> yeah, but we need it every day. Sunday, we're looking at grace through a passage in Ephesians where the writer draws a sharp line between the before and after of experiencing grace. The passage emphasizes the, the power, the necessity, the centrality of grace. Now, I'm not promising that I'll be able to give you a great definition of grace because grace, after all, is a divine concept that is beyond our capacity to understand, much less articulate. However, God gives to us grace all the time. So I know that God will invite you to come away from Sunday with grace. And we'll all be better off for it. So I hope you'll join me. I'll see you either live streaming at 9 a.m. or in person at 9 a.m. And don't forget, you're welcome to join us for Tapestry, the 11 o'clock worship experience. We're talking about the anger within us. So I hope to see you on Sunday.